Let them talk about you. If you take a situation and you leave it in the hands of God and you let it go, remove your hands from it. Yes, that means don't put your mouth on them. Don't talk about them. Don't put your hands on the situation to try to be spiteful or take revenge. And you will see that the God who created them, the God who sees all, knows all, feels all, hears all, he is the judge of all. He will defend you and he knows exactly how to bring justice for you. You will see that the best revenge you could give anybody is no revenge from your own hands, but rather giving it to the God who can do everything and has handled enemies and has won battles for many years. So give God this battle and you will see God bring you justice and you will see the God who has done so much for his children for many many years come through for you but the question is what's more important justice done the godly way or you releasing your wrath upon the person who did you wrong trust me pick the first one and you will see God come through for you all while you still pray for and bless your enemies because that will cultivate your heart and allow your love to grow in general for people because what's better? Like, how do you learn how to love more? When you love people who love you back or when you accept a kiss from Judas all while still knowing how their heart is and still keeping distance because you don't need to have a relationship with those who have done you wrong, okay? Just love them. Keep your heart pure, keep it clean, and trust me, sometimes you're not gonna be able to see God's wrath upon those who have done you wrong, people's consequences. And you need to be okay with not seeing justice all the time, but be okay with not knowing that your God will come through for you because he is your father and he is very protective and very jealous over his children. So you worry about you being the righteous and guess what? Gotta worry about handling his righteous. Let God fight your battles. Remove your hands, okay? okay.